Good morning, I'm Janelle Burrell with your morning digital news brief for this Tuesday, July 14th. A source is telling Eyewitness News that Philadelphia Managing Director Brian Abernathy will announce his resignation today. Mayor Kenny appointed Abernathy to the position back in January of 2019. The coronavirus pandemic and civil unrest put Abernathy in the spotlight. So far, no official word as to why he's resigning. A man is shot and killed in Philadelphia's Olney neighborhood. Gunfire erupting just before 11.30 last night on the 4800 block of North 5th Street. Police say the victim and another man were sitting inside of a car when a gunman opened fire. The victim was struck multiple times, later died at the hospital. The other man left with an injury to his arm. Authorities say they're now checking nearby surveillance cameras for clues. So far, no arrests in the case. And now is the time to see and smell a rare corpse flower because one is blooming right now at Longwood Gardens in Chester County. The six foot tall flower called Sprout reeks of rotting meat and it only blooms for about 48 hours every four to five years today. Maybe your last time to see it. The gardens are open from 10 a.m. until 10 p.m. But you can also see it live on the Longwood Gardens website throughout the day. Now let's get a check out the forecast, Larissa. I know, how can you not laugh after that? Well, but rotting, hopefully people get a chance to see it. Rotting meat, I mean. <laughs> <laughs> that might be a little bit of an exaggeration, but not a pleasant smell, for sure. <laughs> well, you know what is pleasant, Janelle? This forecast. Yes. Beautiful Tuesday ahead as we are going to enjoy a day full of sunshine, low humidity, and temperatures will be seasonable, right where they should be for this time of the year. Philadelphia, you'll see a high of 88 degrees today, 84 down the shore. Poconos will see those temps climb into the low 80s, lots of sunshine, and for the afternoon, we remain nice and dry as high pressure is just dominating the weather forecast and that's going to stick around through Thursday before it begins to drift east and we'll see some rain return to the region as we wrap up the work week on Friday. So Friday promises scattered showers, a few rumbles of thunder and that may linger into the start of the weekend. Your seven day forecast shows that high pressure sticking around at least until Thursday and that means it's going to be nice and dry over the next several days. So a nice dry stretch of weather tomorrow, Wednesday. We're still looking at lots of sunshine, a little bit more humid, but nonetheless, a nice summer day on tap again. 87 degrees here for Thursday under partly sunny skies. And then on Friday, we are wrapping up the work week. That's when our next disturbance moves through. Temperatures will be in the mid 80s and we're looking at scattered showers and thunderstorms. Temperatures soar back into the 90s for the weekend, Janelle. All right, heating up again soon, Larissa. Thanks so much. And remember, you can always get Larissa's most up-to-date forecast and the latest stories right here on CBS philly.com that is the latest for the warning digital brief i'm janelle burrell hope you have a great day